Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game! My name is Dracon the Willem Fuzzbottom Jr. and these are some of my patrons! Snowhazard, and a special thanks to my special sponsor, Lit Dragon! When we last left off, the mayor of Rindo asked us to locate his missing son, who supposedly snuck into the circus. However, it was a trap! The city of Rindo is actually for the kingdom of Brunfost, and now we are stuck fighting against a bunch of puppet things, and we got a boss sitting here. Like an actual boss, with a whopping 35 HP. I know that doesn't sound like much, but compared to the regular enemies here, which only have 15 HP. So yeah, what is this saying? The marionette? So, the puppet master? I'm gonna say it's the Puppet Master, and oh by the way, he's got a level 3 freeze spell. I only just now learned the level 1 freeze spell. Oh boy. I have a feeling that I've got a tough fight ahead of me. Also, there's still the matter of these treasures sitting in here. I'm kind of wondering if I should go after them right now. Well, a couple of them are right by the boss, so maybe I should deal with these guys first. Before I do that, though, I was told that I should abuse my healers a little bit more. Regardless of how much damage I've taken, I should just heal, heal, heal. I'm a little concerned that I might use up my MP too fast, but, um, alright, if you say so. Actually, do one of these? Could one of these use some healing? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, which one do I want? Well, I suppose the more important character would be myself, but Ken could use a little bit more healing. So let's go ahead and do some healing on Ken. Those guys aren't going to do anything quite yet. What are their movement ranges? I want to be careful here. Dire Clown. Oh, these aren't even puppets! I fought puppets in the last episode, but uh, now we're fighting clowns who are not puppets. Their movement range is 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. What, what is their aggro range then? That is the next concern. Alright, have you move in, have me move in. Basically, everybody who's able to move in, go ahead and move in. I'm, at this point, I'm not even concerned about AoE range, or not AoE, aggro range. Uh, you stay put. Your health is a little low. Oh, oh, okay. These guys don't get aggro, they're actually guarding the boss. Is it worth healing Gort for 1 HP? Okay, I know you need healed. Let's heal you. You know, as long as I'm not actually aggroing these guys... That, although that guy has a level 3 spell, so I don't want to get close to him. So, I'll attack from here. What, what is that thing? Edward Scissor's hands? No, wait, he's just holding a few knives in his hand. Long range attacks are going to be the way to go. Even if they're a little bit weaker. I might be slow, but as long as I'm not taking any damage, why not? Alright, can Ken open these treasure chests? Yes, he can. 50 coins. Oh, that takes up a turn? Oh my goodness! 
Oh my goodness! That has range! Oh my goodness, does have it that that the duh! Ah! ah! That's not good! Um Yeah. Hey, me? Don't even get close to that, any of that. I'm going on a mission now to go ahead and grab some treasure. Oh my goodness! Ah! Uh, what, what, what was the range of that attack? Was he at the end of that range, or could it go even further than that? I don't know, I'm, I'm a little concerned now. You, know, you get out of the way. Since you're not getting up close and personal, you don't need to be anywhere near that. You, on the other hand, need to make your way to Ken. You hang tight, Gort. Alright. We got some magic to use. Unfortunately, we only have magic to use with Tao because my princess died. It was kind of unfortunate. Gong, you're also a healer. But you can't get any bit close to enough to anybody to really be helpful in that regard. Arthur, if I bring you in there, you're gonna go ahead and die in one hit. So I'm not sure I wanna bring you in there. In fact, I won't. I'm glad that at the very least those guys aren't doing much. Okay, what is your range here? You can get up to... All of these guys. Yeah, go ahead and heal him. Eventually, he's gonna have to get in there and help out. That boss is gonna need to be taken down as fast as possible. I find that interesting. We're actually going to be dealing with the first boss of the game. And like an actual legit boss. It's going to be kind of painful. Alright, that takes care of that one. And I guess we'll go around and do the same with the other clown. I'm still wondering if we're like within range of his magic. Well, I know how to not be in range of his magic. Go here. Oh, wait. Um... Well, it's his last healing spell anyway. And for the first time, I found a limit to that healing spell. It did not heal all the way. It's kind of interesting. You know, I should have had you move a little bit further so that somebody else would have room to get in there. He didn't attack again? Well, uh, I'm, I mean, that's f I'm fine with that. If you don't want to attack again, you don't have to. A steel arrow, but can't carry it. That took up a turn? Are you kidding me? That ain't right! Ah. Here, use a healing spell on his 1 HP. Hmm. I could have sworn that the amount of HP you healed determined how much experience you got from healing. But no, every time it's 10 experience points. Well, the boss doesn't seem to be in the mood to attack right now, so... Oh, good. We can actually kind of get in range to use a spell against you. Yeah, it's too bad that I can't AoE the boss and the enemy. Oh, 
Uh, what are my options with item give? Am I able to give an item away without using up a turn? Oh, you're not using any antidotes. These guys aren't particularly po Oh, you have to do it to the person next to you. And I bet it does take up a turn. Yep, it takes up a turn. Well, crap. Alright. Somebody needs to get in there to get that other treasure chest. Because, like I said last time, I am not entirely sure that... I'll still be on this map once it's over. I guess you stay put. Can I get over there? Well, I could if my healer weren't in the way. You know what? Save your MP for the boss. And as for myself, oh, almost got to the treasure. Here, back out of the way real quick to... I don't know, I guess here we'll do. Somebody... Eh. Well, I could take that guy down now, but I'll, do, I'll let Hans do that. Or Arthur could do it. No, no. If he gets close to the boss, it's going to be painful. So let me think here. In regards to this range. He attacked Ken here, but has not attacked... Okay, that might be the extent of his range, now that I think about it. So I am just outside the range of his spell. Probably going to want to keep it that way. Actually, Chris, can you get in there and open that? Nope. Um, now I'm going to have to wait around before I can move you out of the way. You know, probably would be better if I actually just checked how full their inventory was before bringing them in. Well, at the very least, I can get a treasure now. Hey, it's a defense potion. Cool. Next turn, I'm using that. You go ahead and... You might be able to kill this guy off. I was going to save it for Ken, but, you know, you could also use the experience. Oh. Well, um, not Ken. Not Ken. Hans. And now Hans actually, I guess, is going to be able to finish that thing off. Okay, get out of the way. Where, who, who has room in their inventory? Here, you finish this off real quick. There. As soon as I'm ready, I'm going to have everybody move in against the boss. In fact, what I could do is get everybody in position just outside of the boss's range of attack. And then have them all move in. Once he's made his turn. So where is the extent of his range? Whoa, whoa. I caused some slowdown. If I'm having my mouse moving around while I'm playing, that causes lag. I hope that didn't mess up the timing of the recording. That would be kind of dumb. Out of curiosity. Da, 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 da. And just to be safe, I'm going to start a fresh recording. And the recording has been refreshed. Alright. You start making your way back in. I don't think you're in any, any position to take part in a fight, but... 
In the meantime, use this defense potion. Oh, <laughs> kind of kind of funny that this is going to be in a battle scene. It'd also be funny if that actually gave experience points. Um I'm actually going to say you're fine sitting there. Yeah, okay. L allow me to take the time to get everybody into position. We still haven't opened this up. Okay, Arthur has room in his inventory. What is this? A steel arrow? Actually, I know who could use that. Alright, I've got given the steel arrow to Hans. That brings his attack from 15 to 20. Yeah, he's going to be useful going in there. Meanwhile, I'm still not sure if I want to go in there. Alright, there's his turn. This is the part where I have everybody charge in and get in their attacks at once. Do you already have the right weapon? No. Let's switch that out real quick. I'm glad that changing equipment doesn't take up a turn, at least. Oh, this is definitely going to take some effort. If only I had the princess still in battle. The extra spell casting would definitely be useful. But I'll take what I can get. Hmm. A few of my characters will probably go down in one hit if they're targeted. Now that's okay. The game has given me a lot of money. So... I'm not too concerned about paying for their revival. They are worth it. Uh, you're not in any position to actually be of super use. Your MP... gone. So you know what? Have some fun. You know... For being a healer, you've actually got some decent attack on ya. Alright, Hans, attack from a distance. That's pretty good. Arthur... Also attack from a distance. Anybody that can attack from a distance, I'm having attack from a distance. That way, my... ...personal space characters can get in there. Hey, every little bit helps against this thing. You're gone, your MP is gone. You also have a pretty decent attack. Oh, I also have that ring, don't I? Oh wait, but I already used it once in this battle, and when I used it, it created a puff of smoke. I, I don't know yet what that was all about. Nobody has told me. Hmm. Alright, May. Good luck. May, my... May... I don't know. Nah. Give Luke room. Luke can kind of cause a lot of damage against that guy, right? Yeah, that's that's a pretty good amount of damage. Uh, this thing's turn is about to come up. Now, unfortunately, Gort does not have room to get in there. Okay, 
So this is what his AOE spell is capable of. As expected, went down in one hit. As expected, went down in one hit. Gong, see if you can cause a bit more damage. If there's a way to get through this fight without losing characters against the boss, I don't know what it would be. So, the best I can do is get in there and try to take him down before he takes us down. getting there little by little I, I think we'll win and now Gort will be able to get in there assuming he gets another turn Alright, whoever can get in damage next is going to receive a crap ton of experience points. Might as well be me. Don't miss. Please don't miss. You better not miss. I didn't miss! Yay! 48 experience. Oh, well, it's not much more than your average monster. Fools! Light will never defeat the darkness. It did before. Oh, oh, that's where the boy was. I was up there earlier. Was he hidden back there? Huh. She, that evil woman, was going to take me to Runefoss to feed me to a dragon. That, uh, that don't sound good. Lit, please don't eat any kids. Thank you. I'm going home and I'm never leaving. That doesn't sound healthy. Okay, so we do actually have the ability to explore around after the battle. You can never be sure, though. I've already had one battle in which... I was kicked out of the battle map as soon as the battle ended, and I did not want to have that happen again. That is, I don't want to be kicked out of the battle map before I have a chance to get the treasures. Your show sucked! One out of ten! It's my fault. I should have noticed that he was in, in there too long... What? Oh. Yeah, he, that he was in there too long. Thank you, Dragon. Too long? No, no... It, I, I, feel, I feel like... It would be expected for a kid to be in there for a while. I mean... It's the circus. I'm sure the mayor is grateful that you saved his grandson. Go talk to him. Alright, but before I forget, I should probably get my characters revived. Also save. Saving would be a good idea. So... Some people are not aware of what just went on, however... I have the chance to see the Shining Force trounce the Runefrost army. Let's uh, see how see this play how it is meant to be seen. Thank you for waiting. Show will begin. Please don't hurt me, Shining Force. I'll change my ways. You'll see. I don't believe you. You'll work your evil again. You'll work your e that is word weird. That is weird phrasing. Grant, how did you know? 
take this. Aye, you've killed me. Pow, bank smash. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'll, I'll, I'll do it right the next one. Thank you and come again. Gotta have that condescending clap. Looking forward to your next visit. This is the worst roll. I should have quit long ago. <laughs> this is a great roll. I wish I could play this forever. I always enjoy these plays. The might of light should be wonderful. Go Shining Force! A fine play with strong performances all around. I've seen it many times already. It is nice to know that the people of Rendo have come around. Thank you so much for saving my son. Thank you, Dragon! Thank you for saving me. Thank you so much, Dragon. Take my ship. It's all yours now. Cool! I got a ship! It would be interesting if we had a battle out at, a battle out at sea. Alright, before I actually... Hmm. Nope. Not open. Eventually, there will be some way to get that to that house that is up there. I feel like eventually these characters are going to be important. Or at the very least, the character who has a character portrait is going to be important. I would have assumed that it was going to be a thing before I finish this here chapter, but um, I guess eventually I'll just have to come back. I assume that's going to be the case, since there is that house that I can't get to quite yet. Yeah, there's, there, I'll probably be returning to this area at some point. There's still the matter of that gopher-looking character that was in the first chapter, too. So, kind of wondering how this is going to work out. Oh, well, we'll all find out eventually. The mayor's ship is yours. Awesome! And can I just... Yeah, I can hop back and forth if I want to. This ship will do just fine. Let's gather the Shining Force and leave at once. You defeated my pets, but you won't bother me anymore. You're going to burn. Burn, Dragon, burn! You'll serve as an example to all who dare oppose Runefost. S something is bound to happen to rescue me. Also, that is the lady who held the trap inside the circus. Good riddance, insect. I'm not an insect. I'm a dragon. Dragon, run! The ship's going down! I'm trying to, but it won't let me. I think I'm stuck in a cutscene. Why are you just standing there? There is plenty of time to get out of there. Oh wait, I can freely move around. Let's take a look at the fire. There is nothing unusual about this purple fire. Now what? This is bad. That was the only ship in town. Maybe the mayor can help you again. Um, alright. Head north to Shade Abbey. You shouldn't have much trouble finding it. Well, alright then. I guess we're not quite ending this chapter yet. Instead, we're going to be heading up to that building up north. What? They burnt your ship? Now we have no single ship in this town. The only other town with ships is Uran Batol, but it's a long way from here. Are you still determined to go? No. Well then, stay here. You'll be fine. Did you change your mind? The only other town with ships is blah blah. 
so determined, yes. Iran Batol is very remote. It's far to the northeast. Go to Shade Abbey first. Ask my son all the details about the journey. Alright. Thank you for so much. Uh, and the same message. What do you know about Shade Abbey? Thank you for saving me. Oh, your, your older son. Alright. Well. Uh, for all I know, I might still be at the end of the chapter, so I'll go ahead and head there now. Alright, finally, this has opened up. Let's back up a bit. I want to see what else is up in this direction. Nothing. Also, that was an interesting looking character here. Help! My name is Eamon! Please save Balbaroy. He'll die unless you help. There's nothing back here. Never mind me. Suspicious. What are we dealing with here? We're dealing with a place. You know what? On second thought, I don't think we'll be ending this episode today. So... Or not episode. What was I saying? Chapter. Well, we won't be ending this chapter today. Did I say episode? Now I can't remember. However, we are, in fact, ending this episode today. In fact, we're going to end it right now. So, down and bada bum bada dum is all of my patrons. And next time, we're going to figure out what's going on in this place. I'll see you then.